Hey, what's up, everybody? Bless up. This is This Day in History, August 13th. In 1521, after months of siege and bloodshed by the Spanish on the Aztec city of Tenochtitlan, Aztec ruler Cuauhtémoc surrenders to the Spanish, marking the end of the Aztec Empire. In 1868, a large quake, estimated at 8.5, hits off the coast of Chile and Peru in the Pacific. The quake caused a tsunami, and the whole region was devastated. An estimated 25,000 people died. In 1792, three years after the storming of the Bastille, French revolutionaries seize and arrest King Louis XVI, and he was sent to Temple Prison in Paris. France would become a republic officially on September 21st, and the monarch would be abolished. In 1892, the Afro-American newspaper is founded by former slave John Henry Murphy in Baltimore, Maryland. By 1922, the paper would be the most widely distributed African-American paper on the East Coast. In 1935, organized and invented by publicist Leo Seltzer, the first game of roller derby is played at Chicago Stadium in front of some 20,000 people. In 1948, a legend who played mostly in the Negro Leagues, pitcher Satchel Page of the Cleveland Indians, at the age of 42, pitches his first complete game as his Indians beat the White Sox 5 to nothing at Comiskey Park in Chicago. Also in 1948, in the first post-World War II Olympiad at the London Summer Olympic Games, the USA men's basketball team beats France 65-21 in the finals to win the gold medal. In 1979, at Bush Stadium in St. Louis, with 44,000 in attendance, Lou Brock of the Cardinals gets his second hit of the game to collect his 3,000th career hit. Brock became the 14th to reach 3,000. In 1995, number seven, one of the greatest baseball players to play, legendary Yankee Mickey Mantle, dies of cancer in Dallas. He was 63. In 1997, created by Trey Parker and Matt Stone, the first episode of the influential cartoon South Park, titled Cartman Gets an Anal Probe, airs on Comedy Central. And this has been This Day in History. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you're having a nice week. Be safe out there, and bless up.